Daisy. It'd be a daisy if he did. Backing up. I think their nest is on that corner right there. All right, whatever. You can have it. Prime spot too. How's it going today guys, catch release fishing? It's probably hard to hear me right now with the uh, Hawking River up just a few feet, but we're gonna try to go after some crappie today. I got some crappie minnows, I'm gonna run a slip bobber. I'm gonna show you guys how I catch crappie down here at the Hawking River. It should be pretty good. It's, we probably got about an hour and 20 minutes of daylight left, so I'm gonna try to hurry it up and try to catch us some fish. Let's go see if they're biting. Let's go. All right, guys, I threw the deeper out there to try to see what we're dealing with under this tree. All right, so we're looking at around four to six feet under this tree, so we'll set our slip bobber at five foot. All right, guys, I'm gonna show you the rig I'm using down here. Just a little slip bobber, and I got a jig head with the crappie minnow on it. Pretty simple tactic, but it works. Let's give it a shot. Oh, did you guys just see that? Something just came up and tried to destroy it when I was reeling it in. That might be him. There we go. Nice bass, nice bass. Ooh, it's a spotted bass too. Check that out. That is a nice spotted bass. Right there on the little BMC Moon Eye jig head. That's a specimen right there. So the spotted bass will have a little patch right here on his tongue. And he also has these little like pinstripes down the side of his body if you guys can see that. And also if he lets me, I'll close his mouth. See his upper mandible? It doesn't go past his eyeball. That's how you can tell between a, a spotted bass and a largemouth bass. Beautiful fish, here you go buddy. Feels nice. Little bass. Oh. Heck yeah, that's a good start. Little chunky Hawking River largemouth. Get a bite. There we go. That's what we've been looking for. Some crappie action. Come here, buddy. A little black crappie here in the Hawking River. There you go, Bob. I think we're getting a bite. Yep. It's a nicer crappie. Heck yeah! Let's go! Another nice Hawking River crappie. Alright guys, we're getting a lot of action here. Slip bobber and minnow. Right under this tree. Just kind of jigging it real nice and slow. Here we go. Up. Another nice little slab here. It's a nice 10 inch black crappie. There you go, buddy. Got a bite. There we go. That is a nice Hawking River crappie. Oh no! Oh. Come here, buddy. This is a beautiful specimen right here of a Hawking River black crappie. Isn't that an awesome fish? Here 
There you go, buddy. Bye. Let's go. Ooh, it's a white crappie. Ah, I believe. Hold on. Nope, it's a black. Buried that slip bobber. Nice thick fish. Beautiful. All right, guys, that's going to bring an end to the video here today. Down at the Hocken River, going after crappie. Successful, productive evening. I fished down here for a couple hours. I caught over a dozen crappie and I caught that nice bonus spotted bass, which is awesome. I love catching different species when I'm targeting crappie. I hope you enjoyed it, guys. Like the video if you enjoyed the content. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys out in the water. Let's go!